The Syracuse Rose Society is blooming with excitement as they welcome back Rose Day at Thornton Park today. Cheers, Channel Lines, Lindsay, right here. here comes another one. She got to smell the roses on this beautiful day, and you can do it too by checking out this hidden gem. Just like the spring flowers and the strawberries, that early 90 degree heat really sped up the roses, too. Take a look at this one. It's called Lady Ursula, and it was planted here in the 1920s. You can't buy it anywhere. And the Syracuse Rose Society was excited to show these off as well as so many others by hosting their Rose Day at the E.M. Mills Rose Garden today. You could find crimson red, sunny yellow, and pretty pink. So many precious petals to count. This garden is a work of love. And it's also supposed to be educational. We want to teach people about roses. We want to uh, debunk any ideas that roses are hard to grow. So we have many different varieties. I think we're up to like 350 different types of roses. Um, we have over 3,500 rose bushes, and we've counted them, so we know. The Rose Society is also excited to host their 101st annual rose show this Saturday at Destiny USA. It's free to the public from 11 until 4:30 in the afternoon. Afternoon. You can go there and learn as much as you want. You can even volunteer here and learn as you go. In Syracuse, Lindsay Rachel, News Channel 9.